E pessoal, bem-vindo a mais um vídeo. Ah, vamos ver aqui. Essa não é a parte da camarela. Ah, príncipe não é o líder da camarela. LaCroix? Shit. LaCroix é apenas o cara que backstabbed e wheeled e dealed his way into becoming king son of a bitch of all the local camarela. Him and any other traders that sided with the Camwant power here, they'll get what's due. Okay. So no trader safado. Então qual é a tua? I learned the way of this world during the depression. A bunch of old rich bastards screwed the country. But did they suffer? No. The little people suffered. You can't trust the people at the top. The world would be a better place without them. All you can do is get a group of people together who aren't assholes. Find a place to put your feet up and make some examples of the quote unquote elite. Keep the rest the hell out. And everyone's an equal here. The same thing this country used to be about. That's what LA has been. An anarch free state. The Camarilla was kicked out on their ass a long time ago. We, the anarchs, didn't want to play their politics anymore. Now LaCroix and crew pop in like they never left? Uh-uh. No goddamn way. Their laws don't apply to us. Então, de acordo com ele, Los Angeles é uma capital de anarquistas, então é livre de qualquer grupo de poder é, político, como a camarela. E agora que o príncipe tecnicamente traiu os outros para chegar no topo da camarela, ele tá bem que tá dando por ordem no, no cafô. Eles não estão a fim de deixar isso acontecer. Você já se encontrou com a câmera? Parece que o seu príncipe dos anarques. Não há such thing. E de novo, Nubi, não se throw those kind of words around like me. You're risking a beat down. I fought to keep LA free since I was embraced. Long time later, I'm one of the only ones left that hasn't fitted or switched sides. The most veteran soldier on the battlefield. Cool. LaCroix represents everything I hate. The Camarilla, stuck-up aristocrats, rich businessmen, crooked politicians. The only place LaCroix belongs is in an urn. Okay. Tem alguma dica pra mim? Uh... Here's what I tell all the new blood. One, you get careless, that blood will make you into a monster. But you rampage around here, you get put down. Two, don't kill when you feed, no reason to. In this city, there's lots of ways to slake the beast without leaving a trail of dead. Three, the Camarilla's full of shit. Four, watch your back, always. And lastly, learn how to fight. Because a speech ain't gonna save your ass when you're staring down the barrel of a shotgun. Come, come over. After picking your ass up off the pavement back there, yeah, I can tell you don't even know the basics. Hold your hands up like this, and keep your body at an angle. It makes you harder to hit. Keep your thumbs out of your fists and put your weight into your punches. Okay. Uh... LA is the school of hard knocks, so keep your friends close and your enemies in a barbecue pit. Once you square things with LaCroix, don't give that son of a bitch the time of night. I got my eye on you, kid. Sure, buddy. Ele melhorou um ponto mesmo. Um ponto de quê? Que que ela matou meu? Subterfúgio? Não. Acho que ele me deu um ponto de brawl. Fala, Jack Boy. Well, well, look at who made it back in one piece. How is Santa Monica, kiddo? Hum. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure it was a stroll on the beach. So did you score a lot of ski ball tickets down on the pier there? <laughs> no price though. <laughs> I can't imagine you did. I'll be too busy getting pushed around by every vampire with a week of seniority over you, am I right? <sighs> What is that? That's usually the way the story goes. Same old bullshit politics from when you were alive, huh? Don't it make you just want to rip somebody's spine out? What? 
saying that's just me? <laughs> uh... Nice. Yeah, not a moment too soon, huh? <laughs> you said you guys let those sabat go too. Lines must be getting soft. How could you pass up that kind of fun? Well, well, he was left sireless too. I don't know, maybe that's it. Well, he's got a thing for the little guy. Interessante. Então ele também não tem um, um mentor. You're free to choose who you trust, kiddo. Sure thing, kiddo, fire away. Come on, Oh, my favorite topic. Don't think that Camarilla has a monopoly on those ideals, okay, kid? No one is arguing over that shit, and if they tell you that's what this fight is all about, then they're really giving you the full fist. You hear me? Hmm. The Camarilla protects the people running the Camarilla. That's it, the end. The rest of them are bloody gristle for the machine. Fat. Camarilla só protege a si mesma. Doddering old dust farts. They might be powerful as all hell, but who knows? They're too afraid to stick their heads out of their hidey holes. And why should they? This whole huge system is built so they don't have to. Mm. Ah, not one of the bigs, but he ain't out risking his ass in the street, that's for sure. Croy has ambitions to join that inner circle. Delivering Los Angeles in their pocket would look killer on a resume. Lá, a Croy parece estar tentando arranjar um jeitinho de entrar nos círculos mais altos da Camarilla. Hum. Ah, to hell with LaCroix. I blasted better vampires' brains all over the wall. He's not the prince, he's a prince. Justo. Uh, já lidou com príncipes como ele no passado? Ah, ele é um típico aventureiro, asshole. Predictable, safe, no imaginação. Ah, man, ele é um pessoal. Ele só teve sorte de chegar em L.A. na hora certa. Ah, ele é o xerife dele. Oh, o xerife, sim. Eu amo como todo mundo está falando sobre essa grande mistura. É como se alguém abraçou um gorila que foi doido. Cara. What else did you need some truth about? Uh, I'm not. That's us, so I'm told. What do you want to know? Mm. Yeah, I could tell you about the history of the movement about our struggle. What's any of that shit mean anyway? Do we want to sit through history class here? <laughs> What's up? I'm no scholar, kid, but I've been around, seen more and done more than most vampires ever will. I don't know that our situation's ever going to be easy, but some things you got to decide are worth fighting for. Just fight harder than the other son of a bitch. Every time I yank a jawbone from a skull and ram it in an eye socket, I know I'm building a better future. <laughs> <laughs> uh. You bet, kid. Como que você não tá? É, como é que você, o cara fodão, não tá cuidando de tudo? Me? I never had much patience for negotiations. Everyone can live or burn, except for them. Cool. Yeah, I'm not sure the story on most of them. Nine's clear. Ah. Bruja. Most everyone here has Bruja blood. Mm. Moving right along. Sabat. Again, does everything have to be about these dickheads? The Sabat are worthless, man. Fake tits on a zombie worthless. Fun to watch, though. Like the Three Stooges with chainsaws. Uh, Qual o problema deles? The Sabat are in the same business as the Camarilla. Sabat have a little longer chain, but 
treat their slaves all the same. Movement right. Mm. What's on your mind? Woman. What about him? What do I think of humans? I don't, really. When you were alive, did you think about cows? <laughs> You know, if one got killed, I bet you didn't cry, but, you know, you're not out there slaughtering them for sport, either. Mm. Ah, man, we got our own problems. Let the kin sink or swim. Moving. Okay. What's on you? What's up? Uh, Politics. The stuff that makes the rich get richer keeps the powerful in power. Look at why you're out in Santa Monica in the first place. Cause Prince LaCroix said so. Uh, for you. Cause he never thought you'd make it back. If Nines didn't stand up for you in the courtroom, you would have been toast right there, man. Everybody knows that. Kidding me, Kenmore. It's bullshit, Camarilla Law. You gotta get it approved before you sire anyone. Vampire population control, fascist crap. LaCroix wanted to look like the strong leader upholding the law. Hmm. Public relations, man. Calculated risk. Vents who are born in a border. When Nines called him out, LaCroix realized it was time to show a carefully measured dose of Camarilla compassion. Hmm. So LaCroix is the middle of Nines? LaCroix is the boss of the Camarilla in L.A. That's it. Hmm. LaCroix is the boss. <laughs> That's rich. Hmm. He's the leader of the Camarilla, but he's not the boss. Uh... The facts are like this. The Camarilla need us to buy into their bullshit for any of their laws to mean dick. Now, telling free-living vampires they need to be ruled is a hard sell. So, the Camarilla baked up a play nicey plan. Show everyone how great they are, so we'll all just jump on board. See. Uh... Kid, we've lived in California, some of us, for over a hundred years, and we've kicked the Camarilla's ass out of town before. Seems like every time they smell blood, they're back trying to take over. Hmm. Who is we? The free living dead, kiddo. A lot of people like to use the label Anarchs. Whatever the hell that means. Anarchs. Does got a nice kick to it, though, huh? <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Um, sure thing, kid. What's on your? Uh. Okay. Crazy Bob. Oh. You're carrying a 6,000 year curse in your blood. No matter how powerful it makes you feel, curse. that blood is a tangle of chains that's going to leave you bound in servitude the rest of your existence. Your elders command the blood, they control the blood, and the blood listens. You'll never even hear their call. But the blood will That shit stretches all the way back to Cain, man. Nothing you can do. Some ancient sleeping in a tomb half a world away has a bad dream, and you don't feel that shit. Like it or not. Cain, man. Father of all vampires. Killed his brother Abel and was cursed by God to walk eternity feeding on the blood of his children. Some heavy shit, man. Keep your voice down. Is Kane real? I don't know. Not sure I want to know. Mm, okay. The 
point is, with this curse pulling your strings, you really want to sign away your right to fight by joining the Camarilla? Uh, não sei. Tá certo, vocês não curtem Camarilla, mas vocês concordam com a máscara? I don't need to bear my fangs to feel good about myself. The masquerade is a fruity Camarilla label. Other than that, I ain't got no problem with it. Live and let live. We got enough to worry about. Okay, I'm in. You know, speaking of the masquerade, I just thought of something you might be able to help us out with. There's this girl who's been making a lot of noise lately. It's a real pain in the ass. She's a ghoul of this one Toreador creep who disappeared. Her name is Pat. She hangs out in the clubs downtown. She used to show up around here and act like she was everybody's best friend. It was all fun and games until her vampire sugar daddy stopped calling her. Now she can't get her blood fixed and she ain't too fun. Okay. Where did she Man, she's been told he was dead. She don't listen. Just ask again loud. Yeah. She's gonna make a scene and get us all. Okay. She's crossed the line. Only time that mouth ain't blabbing is when it's sucking vampire blood. She's gotta disappear. Do this, and we'll keep our little secret, you hear? Mm. Okay. All right. Have fun. I'd love to do this one myself, but I know her side. Sure. Tem que me livrar de alguém então. O que você disse? O que você quer? O que você disse? Bom pessoal, a gente vai ficando por aqui. Até mais.